The lack of court reporters in the Texas judicial system is hitting close to home. Channel 5's Kristen Colon tells us Hidalgo County needs help now. Hidalgo County has four vacant court reporter positions. This number might not seem high, but it is. Some Hidalgo County judges need to coordinate their schedules with the reporters to avoid canceling official court proceedings. A case cannot go forward without a judge or a court reporter. Any official court proceeding needs to be on the record. That job belongs to the individual typing away, or officially known as writing, beside the judge. It's crazy. We probably have right now six people on hold hoping we can help them tomorrow. Mm. And that's what the, you know, many that we're helping. We like to help everybody, FYI. But we yeah, we've turned down already today probably four or five depositions for tomorrow because we're just short. We don't have enough bodies to cover those jobs. Romero and Hill have worked as court reporters for more than 30 years. They are not hired directly by the county. They prefer to freelance. They are getting more than 60 calls a day from court personnel seeking their services. We're certified court reporters. What we do is we take depositions. And what a deposition is, it's pre-trial before you go to court. The attorneys hire us. We go to their office or our office, whatever conference room, we swear on the witness and we take verbatim testimony. And when we are finished with the deposition, we transcribe it verbatim. They mostly do depositions and not trials. They spend hours and maybe days depending on the case. They use a shortage of court reporters in Texas as an advantage since they are constantly needed. Both of these women are based in the Valley. They take positions in other Texas cities some as far as Houston. Channel 5 News spoke to the Honorable Noe Gonzalez from the 370th District Court. He says one of the issues the county has is keeping court reporters for a long period of time. Retirement and pay are also issues. More often than not, when my court reporter has to step out or go to the doctor or take care of something personal or is out of town um, and I don't have a replacement, we can't carry anything out that's official in the courtroom. Gonzalez says other counties in the Valley have the luxury of having court reporter assistance. That is not an option in Hidalgo County. He says this is why they're forced to contract freelancers to step in and help. That costs more. He adds more court reporters need to be hired. Channel 5 News spoke with a representative from the Texas Court Reporters Association. She says there is a shortage statewide, but areas like the Valley tend to suffer more. She adds people need to be exposed to the, recorder, the court reporter's position earlier in their lifetime so it can be an option. Trade school is needed and a certification from the Texas Supreme Court as well. In the studio, Christian Cologne, Channel 5 News at 6. If you're interested in becoming a court reporter, you can find out more at our website, krgv.com. In this Channel 5 News Extra, you do not need to have a degree to become a court reporter, but you do need a certificate. This job can be a second career opportunity and a certification can be done online.